In regards to clothes, I think vintage obviously depends on your age as well because vintage stretches back. Something that's true vintage is something that hasn't been altered. It's come from that time period. There's, it's not mass produced. Yeah, I think vintage clothes are special because you know that you'll pick some. You can go into a shop, pick something, and if you go to a party or you go out, you're not going to be wearing the same thing that everyone's wearing. People buy vintage for various reasons. Um, a lot of it is to to be unique. Um, because pieces obviously aren't replicated all over the all over the high street. It's always quite nice when someone says, "Oh, where did you get that from?" And it's a little gem that you found that no one else yeah. is going to find too. The atmosphere of that era can be created in the clothing and that can be brought out in someone's personality when they wear it. This is my daily wear, yes. For me, vintage is um, the, just the styling and the, the beauty of the clothes and the whole era and the quality of the things that were made back then. and just embracing it at the getting rid of a throwaway lifestyle. I think vintage clothes do have character because I think you could go to a high street shop and everyone can wear the same dress, but it doesn't necessarily bring character to the clothes. I often get people say, what's the story behind a bit of clothing? Um, do you know where this came from? And I think that kind of builds character to the clothes and they think, oh, I like this because this came from that, and they can pass that information on to other people as well. We want things from the past, I think, because it's quite comforting. It um, makes us reflect on our family history, and it's quite a comforting and nostalgic thing to, to look back on. For the younger generation, it's finding that piece that no one's got. And um, for the older generation, I think it's the quality of the clothes 
they like as well because they know they're kind of built to last. But I think with clothing it has become disposable that you can buy a piece and it can they fall apart quite easily and there's no like emotional attachment to them but I think with vintage clothing there's more of trying to keep it because of the backstory. I think there is a big throwaway society still and but I think there's also an up-and-coming um, attitude towards way, the way things should be um, and, not, and going away from a wasteful society. I hope the future of vintage continues to grow. I think as more people find different pieces that suit them and they see that the high street are just producing the same stuff, I'd like to think that they'd come and buy something that, I don't know, is just special to them as well.